Good morning, everyone. Today's devotion from Psalm 123 is about knowing God as master and friend. Because it says in Psalm 123, verse 2, As the eyes of slaves look to the hand of their master, as the eyes of a female slave looks to the hand of her mistress, so our eyes look to the Lord our God till he shows us his mercy. Now remember, this isn't referring to oppressive slavery as we often think of it today. This refers to a culture where it is common for certain households to employ slaves to work for them. So this psalm is not saying that God is oppressive or controlling. This verse portrays God as a trustworthy and generous master. And after Jesus died and rose again, early Christians often referred to living a changed life where we used to be oppressed slaves. Like in Romans 6 verse 18, it says, You have been set free from sin and have become slaves to righteousness. The Bible refers to living your own way as being in chains of sin. Sin oppresses you. We, we choose to have our life chained to something that leads to death. But Jesus came to change that so that we instead would be set free and become slaves of righteousness, people who served God. But actually, Jesus wants to emphasise something greater, that we're not called slaves by God. We're called something else. If we go to John 15, verse 15, Jesus says, this. I no longer call you servants because a servant does not know his master's business. Instead, I've called you friends. For everything I learned from my father, I have made known to you. So when, when you become a slave to righteousness, you become a friend of God. That's how we can know God as master and friend. So today, know God as a trustworthy and generous master, but also as a close, intimate friend. Today, know God as master and friend.